You know what it is, man. DJ Thorough, aka Thorough Zano, Bridge to the Streets. Right now, you're watching the hottest in the streets, right here on ThisIs50.com. You see that right there? That's right. You know what it is, man. I got special guests in the building. Introduce yourself. What up? I'm King Keon. Is this okay, okay? Oh. King Keon. All right, where you it's from? Jersey City. New Jersey, Jersey City. Yep. Wow, name me, name me a famous rapper from, I'm just say Jersey, I'm gonna say Jersey City. Name me two famous rappers from Jersey. Jersey? I gotta go with Lauren Hill, that's one of my okay. favorites. Even though she never showed up, she's always late for <laughs> concerts. Shout out to Lauren still Hill. Still dope, still dope. <laughs> um, I gotta go with the big homie Church. Church, all right, cool, all right. I, I, feel, I, I thought you was gonna say Redman for a minute too, but. Redman fire, Redman yeah, fire. Redman is fire, Redman is fire. definitely, definitely. All right, so you coming from Jersey, man. You out here in the city, what we promoting? What we got, got out, what we got out? Right now I got out my project, Blackheart. Definitely make sure you go check that. That's on all major like commercial streaming platforms. Okay. Um, we leading with the single Holy. Okay. I just dropped the video for that. That's on YouTube. Make right. sure y'all check that out. King Key on Holy. Right. And that's all we doing right, right. now. Just promoting that project. Shout out to my boy DJ Tarzan. Oh, yes, sir. Before, the, before this interview go any further, ladies, if you're behind <laughs> on your rent, you need a little help with your card note, hit up DJ Tarzan. He got you. <laughs> all right. So, <laughs> I don't. I don't endorse that message. All right. <laughs> DJ Tarzan, just send me a cash app. He, he got you. Trust me. Trust me on this now. All right. <laughs> now, shout out to DJ Tarzan. Every time he come through with an artist, man, they they're always dope. Mm -hmm. Like you know, his track record of bringing dope people through is is uh, he's undefeated with that. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's now he told me you you were a boxer too, right? Yes, sir. Now when did you start boxing? Um, I started boxing. I was about eight years old. Eight like, years old. That was my thing. I, I could never play basketball. That's for one thing. Okay. Like, everybody say, oh, rappers usually come from basketball. That was never my sport. Right, okay. Terrible. Right. But with these, right. I was always nice with it. Okay. So I just started boxing at a real young age. My parents had me in there, had uncles in there. Oh, okay. And I just grew up boxing, playing football and all that stuff. Playing football. Yeah. Now, what, what, as far as status-wise, what's the furthest you got in terms of, you know, competing or whatever? Golden Glove champ. Oh, you Golden Glove champion? Yes, sir. Okay, all right. Yeah, I actually fought on my father's birthday. You fought on your father's that birthday? That was the championship fight, April okay. 20th. So, yeah, right. it, was, it was definitely a dope show. Right. right. What weight class you fight? Heavyweight. Oh, you're heavyweight? Yeah. You think you could take Tyson in his prime? I definitely think I could take Tyson in his prime. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Shit, I got to fucking green screen that and put him and Tyson together. See yeah. if I can make that. <laughs> Tyson, one of my favorite fighters of yeah. all time, too. But when you when you're a competitor, right. that's what you like to do. You like to compete. Right. So now, now I don't think I've seen a boxer slash rapper since Roy Jones Jr. Like you don't you don't see like you, I mean you don't see basketball players rapper or rapper trying to play ball. You don't really see too many boxers right. trying to rap. Like I mean, well, just just so we clarify the message. I'm a formal boxer. I'm okay. done boxing. I'm just oh you an don't artist. box anymore. Yeah, I'm an artist. Okay, I'm a music artist. So. I don't want people to think I'm a boxer trying to rap or a rapper that's about to hop back in the ring. Okay. It's not that type of situation. Well, 100, 100 million you would, but well, yeah. yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's the money, right? The money's right, right. But yeah, so music is definitely my number right. one, just for certain. Well, now I'm curious. Now, if you were a Golden Glove champion, why would you stop? Why not go to the, keep going? I love boxing, but so I am music. Right, so if there's something happen that you say, I don't want to do this no more, Nah, well, as far as the Golden Glove, I actually won that recently. So okay. I was already fully invested in music when that happened. So it wasn't oh. like I was about to stop doing right, that right. to pursue that. Because, right. like, realistically, say if I kept boxing, my next goal would have been the Olympics. As I was opposed, about to ask yeah, you that. As you opposed be, to yeah, you're supposed to be the Olympics. Turning I need pro. my tickets, man. You gotta go. <laughs> hey, if I ever did it, I'd be sure I need to, to hit you up right, with the tickets. I need to be sitting right there. Yeah. Cheering you on, man. Holding Word. up the flag, yeah. <laughs> Definitely got to represent. I, I, I need to, I need to be there. Now let's get to the music. What inspired you to rap? How did you get into? How did you get involved in hip hop? Um, well, as far as hip hop, to be honest, I was kind of born into hip hop. Okay. My father was an artist. Who was your father? Crazy Keith. Back oh, then. that's your father. Big I'm, Keith wow, Jersey. I didn't know that. <laughs> yes, sir. You look great, young. Shit. Yeah. That's good. You got good genes. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. I thought that was your brother. <laughs> Everybody say that. Damn. Everybody that's your father. That. Yup. That's pops. Wow. Okay. okay. Yep, so wow, black he, don't crack, baby. <laughs> he had me in the studio since I was a baby. Right, okay. Because he was recording, he was doing his work with Flavor Unit and, and okay. Arista Records and all of that. Right. So ever since I was yeha in the studio. Oh, so you've been in this, like you said, since, since, right. they, since, and, since you can remember. And his father had him in because he was a pianist, he sang. Oh, wow. So he, it was definitely in our bloodline as far as the right. music goes. So I always grew up into it, but I took to it kind of late. I was right. in the sports first. Okay. 
Now, being that your father got you into it, what artists did you gravitate to, towards in terms of inspiration? Like, who did you want to be growing up? I mean, you mean outside of him? Outside of your father. I, 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 yeah, um, yes. I mean, growing up, I'm going to say my top five favorite, the Hot Boys. Uh -huh. first. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you threw me over that right, one. Right. Okay. X. X. Okay. I see that. Pop. Okay. Wayne. Well, Wayne is the hot kind of, that's kind of the same. I mean, post hot boy Wayne. Okay, when, he, right. when he got into that mixtape era. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And um, 50. And 50. Right. All right. So I kind of, so your style is maybe like aggressive. Like lyrically, is that, or you, you say you're like you're lyrically aggressive? Like when, when it calls for it. When it calls for it. Yeah. Well, it calls for it now. <laughs> With that being said, I got this segment on the show. It's called On the Spot. Okay. All right? Uh -huh. I, did, did, did Tarzan tell you about this? He set you up, man. I'm always ready. He lines you up, man. Interview. He sets you up. <laughs> I'm ready. You ready? Yeah. So I got this segment on the spot. We in One World Studios. You know how it go down, man. And this segment here, you just spit and press the hell out of the people and do what you do. I got right? you. I got you. Your pops is watching, man. <laughs> if you don't do good, he gonna get them gloves and take you back. To the band, man. I wouldn't want that. <laughs> <laughs> Let him know the name. Let's get to it. Let's go. I got you. It's King Keon. And look, it'll be a sunk ship. If a nigga jump ship, I avoid questioning on my Donald Trump shit. Hit you with a musket, the money is a must get. Fucking with the yellow post, look like I'm whipping mustard. Not the one to fuck with. Walk, run, jump, skip. Take the girl, leave them bayless, now confront, skip. Everybody seen it, say it, then I mean it. That 40 cool you walk, but, but that Mecca leave you steaming. Homie was a hothead, so we had to freeze him. I don't just rap well, a nigga really breathe it. Hood full of heathens, you wouldn't believe it. Niggas playing tag with the reaper ducking demons. People still losing life, gone can't redeem this. Y'all really want this, me I really need this. Mobbing and we scheming, codeine your man we lean him. Cut from a different cloth, you can ask the seamstress. Can't nobody fuck with me, and I really mean it. 2020 competition, but I never seen it. Ask me how I seen it. If I never dreamed it, they told me it was destined and it happened for a reason. Pull up with that fofo and a black photo. They ain't get the flashing like a motherfucking photo. Mm. Y'all just be thinking shit. Me, I really know so. Hang with some assassins. Now you niggas want some polo? Better lay the fuck low. How I play is cut though. They try to box us in in a room full of blunt smoke. Niggas can't breathe and niggas can't see. They send youngest to school and telling them what to be. But that was never me. My mind been free. First you grind, then speak. First you grind, then eat. My grind don't sheesh. Your grind don't weak. And what I turned into, you could never be. And there will never be another like me. This more than music for streets. Perfection is without a flaw. Used to break a nigga's jaw. Other niggas lit the y'all, they ain't really lit it all. Me, I really did it all. Heart be like summertime, when it come, I skip the fall. Same trick, different dog. Sideline niggas see the game, they don't get involved. Real niggas never change, man, but we still evolve. Been in courtrooms, never been courtside. Suit and tie, having important meetings at portside. I drop jewels, everybody ain't on your side. Life a roller coaster ride, they don't really wanna ride. Do you really wanna try or do you really wanna die? Hit like sweet potato pie, Thanksgiving after five okay. and I don't fuck with these fuckity fucks I'd rather stack these bucks bust a couple of nuts cop a couple of trucks take it off now I'm up go and test your luck if you can quack you can duck get that hustle in my veins now nah, I wasn't born rich screaming you a real nigga really you was born bitch <laughs> king okay okay dope dope <laughs> I caught that Skip Bayless line and, yeah. uh, and the mustard, the porcelain, I caught that. Good I like good catch metaphor. That was yeah. dope. I, I like that. That's dope. So if anybody want to get in contact with you, follow you, holler at you, what have you, how can you do that? Uh, you can follow me on all social media platforms. Instagram, Twitter, at Keon, K-O-K. -K. That's K-E-O-N, K-O-K. -K. Make sure you check out my YouTube channel at K-O-K -K Records. Make sure you definitely, definitely go support that Blackheart project. It's on Apple Music, Spotify, Tidal, all of that. Go check that out and the holy video. And the holy video. On YouTube. All right, before we get out of here, is there anything you want to cover? Uh, share with the people that we didn't talk about? Um as far as as far as this music thing go, I just I just want to give everybody a show. Okay. I want you, you to you, I want you, you to feel, that I want you to feel what I'm saying. I want you to feel where I'm coming from right. and understand who King Keon is as an artist and what the Black Heart movement is about. So right. I'm gonna just keep delivering now, that product. Now, now concept wise with your music, um not to put you in a box, but if someone could, could compare you to somebody, who would that be? Who would you say they'd be compared to? 
Honestly, I couldn't tell you. You couldn't tell me. Because okay. no, nobody I come across be like, you sound like such and such. Right. They'll tell me something like, oh, that song made me feel like right, okay. pop or made me feel like such and such. But as far right. as sound, nobody ever right. said sound was. All right. Real quick. Visuals. You got any videos on YouTube? Anything else? Yeah. That? I mean, definitely, definitely check out Holy. That's first and foremost. Uh, yeah, I was going to say that. What would be the first impression you would want somebody to give you? What would you want them to go check out? King Keon Holy on go YouTube. Go check that out on YouTube. Definitely go All check right? that out. That's what it is, man. Make sure y'all check that out. Support who support you. It's the hottest in the streets. This is 50.com. DJ Thorough. King Keon. You know what it is, man. And like always, when you see us, one knee us. Let me pay respects. Yeah. Ten years, 20 minutes.